Hi everyone, it's Robin. I have a lace haul to share with you. It's all vintage lace and I have enough where I'm going to be able to share so I've added it to my online store and this first one um, is called Brittany and it's like a soft pink and each of these I'll put out, I'll, I have in the store as one yard cuts. So really pretty and detailed and like I said these are all true vintage. Um, and then I have just, a, I only have a couple of that one. And then this one is so pretty. And I only have a couple left of this one because I did post it on my Facebook last night. But I thought I would do a video today. Uh, but this one is called Brenda. And it's really, really delicate. It's an off-white or cream color. And just very, very delicate and gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. So there's that one. I'm going to try not to get these mixed up because I have them already separated and cut. So... This next one I have called Olivia, and it's another cream-colored one, and super pretty. Hey, let me show you this one. Isn't that gorgeous? I love the detail in these, and I just, oh, I wish I had more of them, but um, I love, love vintage lace. This one's a little unusual, a little different. This one I've named Flora. And it has like a minty green accent on it. Whoops, sorry about my camera. Okay, and it's got like a shimmer and really pretty. So that one's Flora. This one I've called Alyssa. I'm, I'm telling you the names just so you can find it easier in my store because that's how I have them named. Okay, this one's like an eyelet. Okay, so I have a... Oh, I probably have 10 bundles of this one. And then this next one I've called... Sorry, it's taken me a little while to switch laces. I have them, like I said, bagged. And I thought, oh, I should do a video on it. This one I've called Bethany. Whoops. Okay. This one's a white one. They're all just so pretty. There's one that's a little more bold <laughs> in color. I'll show you in just a few minutes that it's... It'd have to be the right project, or you have to really love pink, because it's a, it's a bright one. But um, this one isn't it. This one's just a soft pink one, and I only have one left of these. So if you like this one, I wouldn't, I wouldn't wait too long. This one's a very soft pink, and really pretty. And I have the width of each of these on my, uh, on my store. So if you're wondering, just click the link over there. Okay, and again, this one was called Leah. And this one is a super wide, gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous one. Oh, I'm getting too many of them. I've called this one Jocelyn, and I only have a couple of this one left. Let me see. Okay. Very, very, very delicate. I know you're not probably going to... Let me see, maybe that helps. It's really pretty. I know I keep saying that, but they are they are. I just I love knowing that they're vintage and that you know you don't know you don't know where they've been or you know <laughs> that could kind of be a bad thing, but um, you know there's they're just absolutely beautiful. Now this one is more like a trim. It's like a bridal trim, and I only have one of these, and this one is called Macy. You can see it's very wide, just really pretty. Okay. So again, this one's called Macy. And then this next one is one of my favorites, too. I've called this one Felicity. Sorry for my delay. I'm so sorry. Just get your cup of coffee or something and take a sip. Okay, again, this one's Felicity. This is a cream color. I don't know why my camera's having trouble focusing. It's usually not an issue with it, but... Okay, so this one's Felicity, and the next one I have called Annabelle. I was just thinking of, you know, they're vintage lace, so I looked at vintage names and just picked some of my favorites on that one. So this one, again, is a um, another off-white or cream-colored one, and I love the detail on it. Isn't that gorgeous? Really, really pretty. And so again, this one was called Annabelle. The next one is Camille. And this is a white one. It's really delicate. 
and dainty and pretty. And if you want to see any of these uh, closer, uh, you can head over to my store. I have taken pictures over there. This next one I have called Suzanne, not because it's a vintage name, but because it's my daughter's name. <laughs> and so, and I, of course, named one after my other daughter as well. But this is a cream one. And let me see and get a better look of it here. Okay, so this is Suzanne. And I'm trying to keep things talking while I have nothing in front of you to look at. So again, I apologize. I'm moving kind of slow with these, but I have them all separated and, and bagged up, so I don't want to have to you know, try and figure out which one's which again. Okay, this next one is called Abigail, and this is an off-white one, and it is absolutely beautiful. Okay, these are perfect for making flowers or um, just you know embellishments on your mini albums and cards. So again, this one's called Abigail. And the couple left. And I'm almost saving my best for last, or my favorite, if I had to pick a favorite. Um, this one is not my favorite. That's coming up in three more. I'm saving that one for last. But this one I've called Jessica. I don't know why it's having trouble focusing, but I do apologize. Okay, this is Jessica, and this one is about five-eighths of an inch wide. Very delicate. Okay, and then three more. This one, <laughs> this one's probably my least favorite just because I'm not a hot pink person, but I know somebody out there will like it, and I only have a couple of these. Uh, this one I have called, um, what did I call it, Clarice. Okay, let me open it up here so you can see it. It has gorgeous detail on it. Really, really beautiful. But it is a, you know, it is a pink, so you'd have to have it for the right project. But isn't it pretty, though, just the detail on it? It's very delicate and very flowing, if that's a word, flowing, <laughs> when in regards to, to lace. But it is really, really, really delicate and pretty. It's just, the color to me is a little... Um, pink. <laughs> okay, and then this one is a minty green, and I've named this one Gwen. And I'm getting it out of the bag, and then there's just one more after this one. So thanks for sticking with me. I appreciate it. This one, uh, soft minty green. And give my camera a second to focus. And this one, too, is very, very delicate, and um, it's not stiff. It's very, very soft. So really pretty. Again, this one is called Gwen, and I only have a couple of these left. And the last one is my favorite, and I'm so glad I have a good supply of it to be able to share. Uh, but this one I called Kendall in honor of my daughter, so I'm just getting it out of the bag here. And it's so pretty. There, it's focusing. Isn't that gorgeous? I love it. It's absolutely just so beautiful. I mean, you can just tell it's vintage. It's You can't find stuff like this, or at least I haven't seen stuff like this out now. But it has like these little scallops, um, the tiny scallops on top and the larger ones on the bottom. And it has like this, I don't know, it's like a flower or some kind of design, but it's very, very pretty. And these will all take stains and sprays and inks and dyes very, very well. So um, I hope you'll take a look at my online store, and that's keepthepresent.com. And I'll have the link to my store down below. Thanks so much for watching. I appreciate it. Bye-bye.